It's that front for all. Lights off. Lights a little more. Oh, beautiful. Oh! oh. Bar. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> All right, now I can see it. Oh, yes. So, uh, this is a little commercial thing, yeah. and we're going on to... I can't see uh, the thing, Oh, my God, get him. This is forest cover. Shit. Uh, by Trevor Hutchison, who's the author of the And the radio artist is Rito Greedy. Oh, God. <laughs> Right. Which Crap we couldn't make it today. Uh, he's uh, actually finishing up uh, issue three right now, and uh, it looks Ooh. fantastic uh, with each issue. Oh, oh, it's already strong and strong, and I think uh, everybody's loved one, so uh, it's, it's going to be great. So, what do you guys think of the first issue? Yeah! yeah! Oh wow, Crap. that's wow. awesome. Yeah. Wow! Yeah. This is a uh, page we haven't revealed yet. Uh, yeah. 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 Who is the first up here? It's freaking Ravage, dude. Uh, uh, and, uh, it's, it, it's uh, really good to see. I can't really make it all in the video. But, uh, that's uh, that's 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 beauty. Come on. Ravage, yeah. Oh. Oh! oh. This oh. is the Shane Recover by Hutchison and the Guido's uh, splash page from this uh, first video. We'll be when you the tripods. I have a tripod. My brother's got it. He's in the World of Warcraft panel. So, okay, let's turn it over to Shane a little bit. Let uh, him uh, talk up uh, all hell Megatron. I'll, I'll try. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so first of all, uh, like the first issue is out. I, I, I guess you guys enjoyed it, which is really Yay. Um, 
Um, He's over there. Really That's actually over there. We've had a lot of okay, shit over there. criticism. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, which, which I love both of. I just want to say that uh, everybody that doesn't like the book, I love you. And everyone that does like the book, I love you just that little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, what I love is people are passionate about Transformers. If, I brought, if this book came out and people just kind of went, cool and then scratch their ass. That's, that's not what I want to have happen. <laughs> so people that are uh, arguing and uh, getting into heated debates Stupid light, and can't that they want to kill me, that's fantastic. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is that I mean, I'm a huge Transformer fan and if anyone gets me inside and, and I'll do the same thing to, to other stuff, especially the movie. And, uh, <laughs> uh, for me, I know what it's like. So uh, but anyway, the, the book, issue one's out. And uh, issue two's out soon, I think. Two weeks. Two weeks. Um, we're in a position. Hang on a second. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, issue one is almost entirely sold out. Uh, so if you haven't read it yet, it's for sale downstairs. Um, but yeah, I need we're, it. we're looking for sale out of issue one. We're talking about uh, going to the second print. Okay, it's so. the first Transformers sell out. This is the first, wouldn't it? Okay, well, that would be the first time it's sold out. Wow, okay, that's, that's cool. Uh, so, <laughs> issue two is coming out soon, and uh, that's when everything escalates. We're introducing some characters that uh, have not even intri in been introduced yet, that you guys already know. Uh, and obviously, I mean, Gravity is there, and, uh, we're kind of, and I'm doing some tweaks on some older characters. There's a really good uh, frenzy moment in issue two that I think. <laughs> Hey? It's frizzy red or blue? He's a uh, he's he's blue because he has bro so. Oh. Oh. That's, that's how that works. Um, I'm sorry, I had I had my idea. What are you gonna do? Uh, <laughs> and this is issue three. This Lame. Is, this is the issue I have to ask. Gonna, I think depress a lot of people. Anyways, because um, it's, it's really quite harsh. When I was writing it, I kind of thought I'm a bad person. <laughs> <laughs> and you'll see why. There's, they're in a train station, and I don't want to say what happens, but uh -oh. so uh, <laughs> yeah, everything gets a little crazy. And you saw the cover to issue four. I mean, who who likes Trevor Hutchison's covers on the book? Yeah! <laughs> he's uh. He's really amazing, and that, the cover to issue four, I think, is sensational. That's uh, that's Ironhide having a bit of a man cry on the uh, front cover. Oh, that was nice. Let you know that issue four, we're going to see some old friends that aren't actually on Earth. And uh, for anyone that thinks that this is a series that is just about the Decepticons, uh, uh so uh, we're dealing with an all-star cast. We're one. dealing with a, 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 a galaxy-wide extravaganza of adventure and excitement. <laughs> Um, but yeah, you're going to see a lot of a lot of the guys that you really want to see, and uh, obviously, probably like who who hasn't read issue one? Am I going to spoil anything? Great. Obviously, Prime's out of commission, so it's uh, it's getting really uh, really heated. So we'll see what happens. But uh, yeah. I don't know what the next slide is. <laughs> oh, holy cow! Um, so the next slide is this is a guy that um, is dear to my heart. Uh, this is the, the new character we're introducing. Uh, he's going to come up with issue... Where am I? Oh. 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 This is Drift. Oh. Uh, he's hot. His alternate mode will eventually be a Japanese drift racing car. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. I've been bumping into people that haven't heard of Japanese drift racing. I'm like, What's, what rock are you living in? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I mean, when I when I kind of started doing all how Megatron, I looked at all the different guys, and I needed someone that had his temperament. Uh, there's a lot of story behind him, and we're going to be exploring that outside of all how Megatron. We but uh, he uh, he's a special kind of guy. But uh, yeah, he's very Japanesey. <laughs> oh yeah. A lot of credit to, to Guido. A lot of credit to, credit to Guido for two reasons. Number one, the guy's amazing, and uh, his design is sensational. And number two, I am annoyed at crap out of him because I'm so picky. So we went through a lot of different designs, but Guido is just acing everything he touches. And we're talking about his artwork. We're looking at the artwork for issue three, and man, he's just it's incredible stuff. And Josh's colors are amazing. And yeah, so this guy's gonna pop up in. Uh, Will it be a toy? Oh, that's a very good question. Yeah. See how I looked over at Chris, just what can we say? <laughs> what are we allowed to uh, say? This, um, the plan is right now that it will be a toy. It will be the first IDW created uh, character.